All right, guys. We have my back more yaks yeah, like a dragon. Uh, this will, but I mean, if you can't tell by my yawn, I'm not like super, super awake right now. But um, we'll do one more episode because I do need to. Like, I really want to be making more progress in this game. Now let's go. Um, let's say we just added. Uh, I don't even fucking remember his name anymore. That guy, the guy in the back. Uh, so we're going okay, well, yeah. Um, I love how this even tells his name here. <laughs> Um, yeah, we should actually see what other uh, uh, Dachi, Dachi, Namba, and Kasaga. Yeah, what are the, I, I don't fully get what these are. Like, what are the jobs? I, mean, I guess they're stuck with it, aren't they? Okay, whatever. So in the last episode, I was kind of just, um, Talking about my favorite soundtrack, or favorite songs specifically, in all of gaming. I was just playing some of them. Yeah, it sucks that I, I did make this playlist um, on my account of like all my favorite songs, and like some of them aren't there anymore. Uh, some of them were taken down, so I guess sucks. It played the Revelations theme. You see, three themes are really great too. I mean, again, like I, I thought it was like I, I think just generally I love Assassin's Creed music. Like, even though a lot of that may stem from nostalgia, I just generally do love that music, though. I was the Black Flag has some great music. Um, <laughs> like, I, I think the Rogue's theme is pretty fucking good. I really, I think most of the themes are really good, right? It's like, what, like, which game has the worst theme? I mean, to be honest, it might be, like, I love the beginning of Unity, but it's like, be, after the beginning, like, it just kind of fades, or, like, it just becomes, like, whatever. Yeah, like here, like this is the like halfway point of the song. I think like by then it kind of loses steam. But whatever. Uh, I love Catherine's soundtrack, but uh, I think you got like Stray Sheep being a memorable song for me personally. But it's really like at the end of the day, it's definitely not a soundtrack that I'm like super super into um, anymore. Double Trigger, every guy had that on here. Yeah, I played God of War theme. I still can stand by that. Uh, I got Aloy's theme. It sucks that some of these songs are gone. How am I supposed to know? Oh, I, I've seen this scene before. Again, not gonna bother playing Kingdom Hearts music because more than likely <laughs> I'm gonna get uh, gonna get blocked from it. But it always seems great. To be honest, I might just end up deleting this playlist because it's really useless. Because like majority of the video or songs that are on here are gone. Or um, or uh, left. I mean, obviously you got Red Dead uh, soundtrack, which is fantastic. <laughs> Actually talking about like I don't know, well, he got unspoken, which is really great. Uh, you got the Shinmu theme. I fucking love the Shinmu theme. You got Lasso's music. And here we go. 
The last was music really great. Yeah, all gone is the yeah this one. <laughs> I think this is the one that plays at the end of the game, right? Um, Witcher 3? I kind of forgot about the Witcher 3 soundtrack. I don't remember which song is which, though, anymore. The Witcher 3 soundtrack. It feels like it's been forever since I played The Witcher 3. I, mean, I think it's been almost, like, it's almost been a year. I believe it was last March that I played it, right? But it really does feel like forever. Uncharted. What? The entire Uncharted 3 soundtrack got taken out? That's kind of shit, isn't it? We got Thieves on here. Ah, of course I don't know. I went and Um, I think we're gonna go for like this guy. Oh fuck, let's go. These people are a lot of help. Oh fuck. Doing at him now. Um, I don't remember what was the Death Stranding soundtrack. Like I remember the BB theme being one that like was like talked about, but I don't even remember what the fuck the BB theme was. Um, yeah, BB's theme here. You got Last of Us Part 2 soundtrack. Uh. 
Yeah, you got Somnus. I, I talked about Somnus is probably one of my favorite songs from video games. Uh, this is one of the lyrics, I don't want the one lyrics. But then we got Valhalla's theme, which I haven't listened to Valhalla's music. I haven't listened to it as much as I probably should at this point. I really do love the main theme. <laughs> Was it King of Wessex? I remember there was like one random song that I really, really liked. I was trying to think of like which song that was. Maybe it is King of Wessex because it looks like this is a song that I've listened to before from this. Uh... <laughs> so, oh, it's this song. Yeah. the Final Fantasy 7 soundtrack that much. I always say it's great, but I haven't really listened to it that much though. Outside the game. Tifa's theme. Ma, 
Music that was cut out of that, though. I like got taken down. I'll look this up. I, I, I'm trying to look through the collection. I'm just trying to see any notable ones that like weren't there. Cause it's more than likely uh, ones that were taken off. in there? I don't remember. It's like it's all in alphabetical order by game and it's like so I know like what general letter range I should be looking at with certain games. Cannot be selected. <laughs> yes, he would. Hmm. Let's see if this works. Oh, what? How kind of tough was that? have we even played recently? Like, I guess it's been Yakuza, Miles Morales, and Avengers, right? So I guess there hasn't really been anything super notable from those games, music-wise. I mean, like, Yakuza has some good music, but it's like, it's not anything, like, to the level of, like, some of the other Japanese sort of games. Um, like, you know, I mean, like, comparing Yakuza soundtrack to fucking Personas is, like, a joke. And then same thing with, like, Final Fantasies and all that sort of stuff. Last of Us and Uncharted have great music. I don't even remember any cyberpunk music at this point, if I'm being honest. Hitman's kind of forgettable, music-wise. Watch Dogs has some good songs, but like not really that many great ones, though. And Ghost Tsushima has some good songs, right? To be honest, I don't even remember anymore. I feel like it does, though. <laughs> I just, I just looked at this channel, and there's 6.4 thousand videos on this channel. That's really fucking, like, mind-blowing. So it's actually th at least 3,200 hours of me playing games is on this channel. I don't remember. Like, what's the theme of Ghost of Shame? This is Jin's theme. Later becomes the good song. Yeah, I think it is, right? This is the one that plays in that scene where we first get into the open world. Yeah. 
Kwame. Like what, what are the Kwame song? Zero. I feel like there's one song in particular that I really liked, but I just don't know the name of it. Oh, it's Judgment. The song Judgment from the X is Zero. Not actual Judgment. Judgment. Guys, at this point, I'm just kind of just waiting until we just fucking end this episode. They stopped doing their shit. Bizarre, I completely forgot that we were saying. 
For some reason, I like their fucking interview of Dan Foley. Uh, that's kind of funny in retrospect. It is funny. Like, I haven't liked a video. Uh, I've only liked one video in the last, like, five years. Uh, which means I don't like videos. <laughs> As in, like, I don't click like on videos. Um, I forgot about that. P and Abby used to do fucking reviews of uh, Survivor episodes. Uh, that's funny. In retrospect. Oh, they delete or did they unlist a lot of their videos? Yeah, they did. Huh. That's shame. It's bizarre too that to think about it. like it's been more time since um, they did those videos than what it had been since they had played Survivor when they made those videos. That's insane to think about. Um, we got the Survivor funeral of Shane Powers. I'm gonna keep that out. I forgot about the vote for Spencer things too. Yeah, my fucking likes are like so fucking uh, RGP heavy. <laughs> It's like recently it's so RGP heavy, but like before that it's like so game collection heavy. Oh, and my own videos too. I used to like my own video, that's really fucking sad. I'm sure, I mean like to be fair, I know a lot of people do it, but I haven't liked a single one of my own videos from a new channel now. It's weird though looking back at some of these channels. That existed, that I used to watch. <sighs> yeah, it's so weird too. I remember I used to look up these channels, but like, but then like now I have more subscribers <laughs> on my other channel than like these channels ever had, which is like the bizarre thing. Uh, like obviously, there's exceptions. Like, there's obviously like. Other YouTubers that like have way more subscribers than I have, still. But so there's like a lot of like small, like relatively small, like YouTube channels from back then that like I used to follow uh, pretty intently. That like now in retrospect, it's like again like these people out there have like uh, Ari Lewis 2011. It's one that I remember I used to watch his like collection videos all the time, and he. Um, um, yeah, he had movies and stuff like that, and like, yeah, he only had 2,200, or, yeah, 2,200 subscribers, or he only has that now, so it's like, I don't even know what he had back then. Um, so that's insane to think about. Obviously, there's, like, people that do have a lot more subscribers than I do, like, Happy Console Gamers, TJR, Metal Jesus Rock, stuff like that, but, um, Game Chasers, Pete Door, um, but again, there's like these other channels that like just aren't as big as I remembered them being. Uh, 
Yeah, Lost Gamer 8519. I remember watching him a lot. Uh, and like, I believe I even talked to him a few times online and everything. Um, yeah, like looking at this now, it's like he only has 800 subscribers. <laughs> Uh, which is like again insane to think about. Um, the survival review, I forgot that was a thing too. Uh, there's another guy that I talked to here and there online. He had 2.4 thousand reviews. Oh, they're still doing fucking videos! Okay, one of them is. It was two guys, and uh, one guy was like a game collector, the other one was a movie collector, and it's like, it looks like the movie collector guy is still doing shit, but like the, uh, game review one isn't, which that's the guy I talk to more online, um, yeah, like, looking at this, like, their most viewed video is why Michael Keaton is the best Batman at 13,000 views, <laughs> like, for me, like, 13,000 views, like, there's certain videos that if I release 13,000 views, like, that's an underwhelm, that's underwhelming, um, so that's insane to think about, uh, Business 17, like what's he do? I know he's still around. He's at 11,000, so he does have more subscribers than I do. But again, there's like definitely these channels that like, I remember being so big when I was younger, but it's like in retrospect, they're just not. <laughs> uh, how big is 8-Bit Eric? I'm sure he has way more than I do. I'm sure he's at like 50,000 maybe. 82,000, okay, so he's, yeah, he's definitely. Up there, um, I'm just scrolling through Truman no Talks Treasure, I forgot about him. Uh, I never really watched him that much, but I forgot that like, the channel existed though. There's a lot, like again, it's, it is pretty nostalgic watching some of these things. Or like looking, scrolling through these, my old likes, Thrift Dwellers, I forgot about them too. How much subscribers do they have? 3.6 thousand. I think that's insane to look at. Uh, um, I don't know, I, like, I, was, I was just like really into the uh, game collecting scene. And a lot of channels that. Canadian Retro. How many subscribers is he at? 1.4 thousand, that's insane. And he's still fucking doing it. Mean, as of three months ago, he was doing shit at least. That's insane. Oh, shit. Well, right, we'll, we'll just do stick straight up attacks. Ultimate Floyd, I forgot he was a person too. Oh my god, it's like the quality of his videos are such shit, but it's like, I remember I really did respect his opinions on things back then. Um, looks like he's still, like, as of a month ago, he still did videos. So that's something at least. He did top games of 2020. Uh, Heine House. And that was the EME review at the time. Um, Game Chasers, Pete Door, Game Chasers. Yeah, it really is insane to think of, like, like fucking, again, this is only like, what, six years ago? seem to think that's only been that long. Except how long it feels like it has been. Yeah, I'm gonna delete some of these. Some of my, uh, liked videos. It's like some of these, it's like, I don't need to be here. I feel like I like, really condense this to what? Uh, Kid Shuriken. What does he have, subscriber-wise? Okay, he actually has a good chunk of subscribers, 25,000. Uh, well, let's just go for him again. Why is he not done yet? Uh, 
Oh, he's still doing shit. Interesting. Yeah, there was this channel that I remember, like, when he started. Um, like, I, uh... Actually, is this the guy I'm thinking of? Maybe this isn't the guy I'm thinking of. Yeah, like, he did videos very similar to I did. And, uh, it looks like he's still doing shit, though. Interesting. Did not know that. I was like, um, Gamer Bros. What's wrong with Gamer Bros? I don't fucking remember. And now I'm turning this into like just a nostalgia trip of looking back at all their YouTube channel. Oh, I do remember them now. Holy shit, he's so fucking old now. That's mind blowing. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I do remember, yeah, they were like, I mean, they're like my age, so it's like now they're like 25, which is like fucking weird. Uh, again, it's so fucking weird to think about how, like, how much time has passed. Since I was doing, like, these game collection videos and everything. Um. Yeah. Um, don't care, obviously, about what's going on here. どんだけどん底の町なんだよ、ここは。まあ、地域に慣れるさ。こんなのに慣れたかねえよ。ほうほう。こいつは珍しい。あ。やはりこれは俺の図鑑には登録。やはり、これは俺の図鑑には登録。
Wow, right uh, 64 bit fanatic. Is that some? I feel like that was someone I used to like. Yeah, I feel like I even. Like, I. Kinda. Um. Mirrored my uh, thumbnails after his, but, like, not really. But mine are much worse. Mine. <laughs> my thumbnails are so bad. It's so funny. Thinking back. Um, especially now. Actually, it's so. F I have a fucking Serbian film on the fucking cover of one of my fucking thumbnails. <laughs> oh no! Oh my god, dude. It's like looking bad at this channel. It's like it's so bad. Like it's really like. Oh my god, it's so bad. Game Hunters are us. I don't remember them at all. Couldn't fucking tell you anything about them. But, uh, yeah. I mean, like, it's fucking funny how bad this channel is. Games of War. I forgot that was a thing, too. How, how many subscribers did he get? Oh, he's actually at 18,000. So, like, he didn't actually do decently well at one point. Oh, I forgot about this guy too. Ah, oh, fuck me. Aaron Kozarski. This like really fucking sketchy looking guy. Um, yeah, that was like a video game reseller like show like that. Uh, actually, it looks like he still does fucking videos. But, like, I remember there was, like, a point where, like, he was, like, trying to sell, um, like, a reality show or something. And, like, he, yeah, like, there's a, his, one of his most video, viewed videos is, like, him proposing to his girlfriend. It's, like, the most fucking awkward thing. Like, it's such a bizarre fucking thing. Um, that, that's still, <laughs> Grimsy42, I forgot he was a person, too. <sighs> um... But yeah, how much subscribers did he get to? 7,000, okay, so I'm actually like, slightly more than what he has now. Um, I, I, again, I don't care about anything that's going on within the game here. I thought I used to fucking like, like pretty much any video I would watch. Now it's like I literally could not give a shit to like anyone. Um. Yeah, this channel is so bad though. I think that'll be a fun thing to do at some point. Is like, uh, look back at like the my old channel. It is funny too how like I used to like like my most viewed video on this other channel, my old channel, is four thousand seven hundred views. I remember looking at that. I was like, holy shit, that's a lot. But it's like now that's fucking terrible. Like, how many videos do I have now that are over four thousand seven hundred views? It's like so many. And like again, these thumbnails are so fucking bad. It's like it's a, a like abysmally bad like the only positive i would say about it is um the fact that i do have my face in it <laughs> but like outside of that like these thumbnails are really bad like um oh my god it's like what the fuck was i doing <laughs> like how the fuck did i make a channel for 111 fucking game collection videos and still this fucking bad. I just got my Yakuza on my, on my uh, PS2 collection. I forgot that I actually used to care enough to fucking, uh, edit these videos. Fuck, we're fighting now. Pfft. <laughs> <laughs> 
that's because all my PS2 games are over here. Um, yeah, I have 390 PS2 games. How many PS2 games do I have now? I wouldn't be surprised if it's actually not that much low. I, I, I'm sure it's lower. Actually, what were the last collection videos I did on this channel? Let's actually look this up. In Megacon 2014. Um, okay, that might actually be... Yeah, that was actually the last collection video I did. Alright guys, it's BLM here. It's time for another video. This is gonna be my PS2 collection. That and... Um, there was a PS1 collection video also I did. Yeah, let's just do, um, auto. Oh my god, I fucking like edited like air. Oh. Oh, this is so fucking awkward. I'm pretty sure I am like an easy like 40 pounds lighter in this though. <laughs> Oh my god, I just fucking like cut between it. Oh, that's so fucking weird. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so awkward when I'm just like fucking editing through like just saying the names of games and then all of a sudden I just stop the fucking talk about this one. <laughs> I get like I used to collect everything, like try to get complete sets. Just couldn't be bothered to do that anymore. But it's really not that good. Asterix and Omelette, uh, Kick Buttocks. Actually, it's a pretty decent platform. Uh, I recommend it if you can find it. Pretty hard to find, though. Uh, Athens 2004, ATB Off-Road Fury 1, 2, 3, and guess what? I have the fourth one as well. Automa Alista, I like the green. <laughs> oh, fuck me, this video is so awkward. <laughs> oh, this video is so bad. Oh, it's so funny. And like, to be fair, this is probably one of the best videos I've made on the channel. <laughs> like that, that's how fucking bad this channel is this whole. What's this collection video actually? Collection video for 2014. Yeah, that is my video game collection. I have a decent size collection. I have uh... Actually, wait, how many games do I have at this point? Uh, wireless controller that I use. <laughs> Let's actually go back to this. Say like what, like 30, 40% of it is filler? Games, I believe. Even though I have a good amount of games, I wouldn't really... I have a decent size collection. I have uh, 1,800... 92 games, I believe. Even though I have a good amount of games, I wouldn't really consider my collection that great. Because I'm thinking like what, like 30, 40% of it is filler. Uh, as you can see like right there, like the white games right there. Wait, what was I playing on the TV? There, my consoles are over here. That area, and there's a TV which is playing The Walking Dead. This is uh, Walking Dead Marathon on right now. This is my Cool. I guess that's what I was fucking doing in fucking 2014. Uh, Why the fuck was I watching Walking Dead of all fucking things? I actually use this all the time, yeah. It's Sports. Mark Echo's getting up. Kind of disappointed by that game. Um, this is funny though. This is such a bad channel. <laughs> My 23, 2013 room tour. All right, it's BLM here. It's 
time for another video. This is going to be my game room tour for 2013. I've been wanting to do this video for quite a while. 2013. Tour, um, but I just haven't had my collections I'm getting. Um, just really want a Saturn, but the games are so fucking hard to find. Same thing with the I Wii game. Um, yeah, we're going to end here. This is bizarre to watch, though. I forgot I did Tony Hawk. Top 10 Tony Hawk games. This is 10 years ago. Over 10 years ago. Oh my god, I look so fucking skinny here, too. That's actually one of them. Do I even have the games in front of me? Oh, I, I do eventually. Yeah. So, 8 is Underground 2. Why? Why is 8 so low? <laughs> Why is Underground 2 so low? Uh, 7, Pro Skater 1. 6, Pro Skater 4. Or do I... Do I not own all of... Wait, this is a bizarre fucking list, by the way. I 100% do not stand by this list at this point. Wait, wait, wait let's just... This is such a bad video. Uh, one of my favorite games of all time. Definitely in the top 20. Um, Tony Hawk Ride, number 9. <laughs> it's like, I, I love how I don't even fuck. It's a fucking four minute video, and I don't even remember the list by the end of the fucking video. Underground, two. <laughs> number 7. I really messed up on these numbers, then. Oh, well. Number 7 <laughs> is Pro Skater. Number I look so skinny here, though. Holy shit. Five, Project A. Four, American Wasteland. Three, Pro Skater 2. Two, Pro Skater 3. And number one is Underground. Thanks for watching. Wait, 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 wait. Four, no American fucking Wasteland. way this is my real list. Three, Pro Skater 2. <laughs> two, Pro Skater 3. Okay, and this is the thing I will say also, is that I know back then I would definitely, um... Again, like, now I say my true opinions on things. I don't give a shit what the fuck other people think. I remember I used to really do think, like, I care about what other people thought. Um, I, I did used to, uh... Like, I, I, to be honest, I'm pretty sure I lied in these videos a lot about, um, certain things. Like, my opinions on games. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of points where I say, Oh, I've played this game, it's great, when, when I, like, in reality, I've never played it. Um... Uh, I think, like, there's a lot of things, like, where, like, I used to care a lot about, um, what other people think, and, like, now, obviously, I just don't give a shit. I forgot why I did top ten underrated games. Actually, it's funny, it's, like, it's really not, like, it's really just my face, I feel like, that looks skinny. Like, I st I'm still, like, not skinny here. It's just, it's more so like my, I, I feel like I put like weight on my face, of all things. Uh, whatever, who fucking cares. Again, like here, like Silicon Valley, I barely played it. Like, I, I, I did play it, but I, like, I, I barely fucking played this. I usually play it almost right away, because um, I like getting my own opinion and seeing yeah, sure. I, I definitely do. Especially at this point. Uh, Vanquish. I mean, I, I generally did love Vanquish. I mean, that, that's not something that's changed. Mojo. I mean, I liked Mojo. Um, Duke Nukem Forever, sure. Uh, I, 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 I didn't hate Duke Nukem Forever. Alter Echo I did generally enjoy. Okay, so maybe this list is actually probably relatively accurate. I think Space, Sil Space Station Vil Silicon Valley, that was, like, really... Metal Arms, I barely played it. Okay, I love Prince of Persia, 2018. Or 20, 2008, I mean... How far into summer? We were 24 minutes. <laughs> Amazing Island, I don't think it's fine. I never played it that much. Dark Watch, barely played it. <laughs> uh... Uh, Go Hyper Green's good. Uh, and then what last is Code Rimpa, I'm assuming. Or did I, did I, I mean, Yep, it is Code Rimpa. I mean, as a Wii title, um, is it brilliant? Um, <laughs> good. I mean, 
think it's good for what it is. <laughs> All right, guys, be like, oh my time god, time. what the fuck? It was 16 minutes. <laughs> a pretty long video. Like, I, I can't even think of the last fucking video I did on my other channel that's less than 60 minutes. Great game, very underrated, didn't get good reviews. Barely played Avon Rising. All Star Baseball 2003, All Star Baseball 2005, Ultra Echo, another other rate title. I, I did genuinely like Ultra Echo, though. Technically, not really the greatest game, but it is a pretty decent game. You know, I, let's do this at some point. Rewatch my old collection videos and just comment on them. I, I still stand by that. Yeah, like here, this is like, um, this is like what me, this is like around one of my last videos I did. So this is like, yeah, mid 2014. Um, like here, I'm definitely like chubbier <laughs> like I'm definitely like what I look like now but yeah like when I get like back 10 years ago it's fucking mind blowing like how different I look then I would say that's actually true for the time it's not anymore I was like but I, I didn't even play it <laughs> I never played Chicago Enforcer either <laughs> Yeah. Sky's great game, actually. It's like one of the most yeah, I mean, Sky's a pretty good game. Never finished it, but. Do it. I could stay up and like do this. I, I kind of want to, especially because I'm not gonna be recording much tomorrow. I kind of want to do another episode, and we're just gonna talk through. Uh, or we're just gonna listen to some of my old videos. Um, see, so yeah, let's do that. For now, thank you for watching. Though.